good morning, folks. Happy whatever Wednesday, which for now, that is still going to be high engineer, especially with the new uh, update, which makes us uh, growing plants and making soup. <laughs> it's it's a lot more fun than I expected it to be. And we just kind of want to see how we can progress along with it compared to the normal stuff. But yeah, we'll be doing that today. But before we begin that, I am still fundraising for the LGBTQ Freedom Fund, which helps pay bail to secure the safety and liberty of individuals in jail and immigration detention. They also work to address the disproportionately high rate and harm of jailing on LGBTQ folks, which is a tangle of discrimination and poverty. Because, all, for better or for worse, a lot of LGBTQ folks are not as um, ingrained in society and have are worse off financially, so... Yeah, poverty is a problem. And discrimination is definitely a problem still as well. So, if that sounds like something you'd be interested in donating towards, I have a button below my stream, specifically for Tiltify, for the LGBTQ Freedom Fund. You can click that. I also have a chat command, exclamation point, donate. That will get you there as well. will get you a link. And every once in a while, my chat bot will share that link in the chat as well. And whenever the stream screen comes up, we will have a QR code that will take you to the fundraiser as well, if that's how you'd like to do it. My chatbot also shares my Discord link to my Discord server if you're interested in that as well. Any way you choose to support the fundraiser, I really appreciate you for it. It's a good cause. All right, let me get the game going. It takes like a sec to kind of load up. Let me see where are you at. Uh, okay, there we go. Uh, well, I don't feel quite as dead as I did yesterday, but I guess we'll see how that pans out. <laughs> it's like watching a little leaf flop around. The game will be up soon. Yep, I can see OBS is screaming at me about encoding overloaded, which means the game is probably loading. Which is weird because I just... OBS is just weird. Come on, game. Yeah, there it goes. Just taking its sweet fucking time. <laughs> I mean, I kind of did this morning, too. I kind of got up a little earlier to my alarm and just kind of was going at a snail's pace. So, can't really be too mad at the game for doing the same. Come on. Dude, at this point, I probably should have started the game up, like, a few minutes earlier than this, because, like, it's still loading. It's weird. It's not that fucking complex of a game. I don't know why I would be having pr problems, <laughs> but whatever. So stare at Twitter <laughs> while uh...
Come on. Come on, game. Jeez, really? I'm gonna, to, I'm gonna have to close the. I'm gonna close the game and reopen it again because this is this is a little silly. Fine, control delete. Fuck you, game. <laughs> why? Why? Why are you being like this? Go away. All right, let's try this again. I just want to make some fucking soup, damn it. <laughs> just let me make some soup. Is there like an update that caused the game to not launch? Hmm. I am concerned. In the meantime, I guess I'll scrape the cat hair off the front of my, my desktop. <laughs> Cause when you got cats that shed, it kind of happens. Uh, seriously, all oh, this is exhilarating. <laughs> well, there's not much else I can really do except just kind of wait. We're having a lot of fun here staring at the black screen of the game trying to load. I hope y'all are having a better morning than I am. <laughs> oh, sweet golly geez. Come on, really? Why is the game deciding to do this now? It's literally working fine last week, and now it's just like, mm, no. Oh, there it goes. Why does this game fucking suck at loading? You know what? It's fine. It's fine. It, 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 we're here now. What is going on with this fucking game? Alright. We're good. We're in. <laughs> Sweet Jesus. Alright. So we've been steadily just kind of making more plants happen. And doing these orders for uh, just a pile of vegetables on the ground. <laughs> on the dirt. We got our friend crab guarding all of our crystals. We got our tokens here. We've got... Uh, we got some orders, I think. I thought we had some orders. I, that or I think either we had had some orders or we did all of them. I can't remember which is which. Weird. It seems. Like, I don't know if someone already got picked or if like what happened with this particular plant. But whatever. We're gonna just uh, free the free the tomatoes, free the nipple.
a little more tedious to do it this do it this way with carrots because the hitbox is a little weird. No, I, I don't. I, I that, wait, that that one that one must have been uh pre-picked because like if it wasn't fully grinned, she would have gave us the seed back. <clears throat> Well, let's grab our handy dandy magnet on a stick. Let's. Grab as many of these carrots as with that want to come along with me. Okay. Come on, carrots. We got like 28 seeds. Yeah, we have 28 tomato seeds, so these can all just become um, delicious um, chopped tomato for soups. To add to the rest of the, to the other pile over here of just dirty tomatoes. Okay. And we have like five there. This side over here seems, as less, seems to have less growing problems, so I think we're going to, um... Let's see, do we have any... We, have, we do have some of these pipes. I think we could probably put these pipes... Up like this to uh, make growing things a little more uniform. some more pipes, like two of them. Come on game, it's fine. Save. Find bad prices in the base. What is going on with this fucking game? I do have a suspicion. I am trying to like upload a lot of uh, VOD stuff to YouTube right now, and maybe that's part of the problem. Yeah. Oh, that one was a save. <laughs> so it probably is part of the problem. Give me a sec. I don't know why I didn't think about that. That's silly of me. I don't know if there's some way to like make it not. I don't want to cancel that upload because I've been having them going since like last night, but eh, I think we'll just make, have to make deal. Take a look at my goods. Oh, I think I already bought them. Grab like ten of these and turn them to seeds. Up oh, the bin wants to behave. Three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, ten. That's five. Do my eyes deceive me or did I get like 20 seeds? I think I got 15 because I think I already had 5. If I could just do the play the game properly, that'd be great. Uh, 4, 5, yep, that's, five, that's 10. Yep, okay, so I've got 20 seeds. That should be more than enough to kind of replant the rest. That's all makes this a lot easier. Count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we've got eight each there. Let's see. One, two, three, four. If I get eight more of these T pipes, I'll be able to um, have like 40 plants, and I can just grow a bunch of carrots all at once. Because they probably it's probably worth it to grow those in bulk since they grow slower than the uh, tomatoes. Using a lot of our precious money to buy more pipes, but that's fine because the pipes will let us grow more stuff so we can make more money, make more soups, all that fun jazz. It's a floating, it's a floating pipe, don't question it. <laughs> <laughs> through the power of positive thinking. I'm sure there's some better way to do this than what I'm doing, but well there is, it's called sprinklers and we don't have them yet. So for now this is kind of our best way to like try to get things done. We should have 40 dig spots. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Yep, we got 40. So we can plant 20 of these carrots, and then we'll just probably fill them. And we'll probably just fill up the rest with um, tomatoes. either the sprinklers by the end of today's stream or I want the uh, farming machine. Mm. 
either would be a very nice uh, upgrade. these seeds in reserve for whenever I feel up to dealing with them. I think our, I think our problem now is we're, we don't have any orders, so we need to go find people that want fucking soup. Okay, there's some, there's one person up above, on the hill above where we are. Like, up there, I think, so. Let's try to Skyrim horse our way up this hill. Probably like up here, so yep, it's right here. Fetch me some scrum. What do you 22 to god damn? Alright, well, you heard the man. I might just go ahead and get him his, his soup now since it's 22 just tomatoes and we got plenty of those. See how much we got now. 25. Okay, we could probably trim off a little bit there and get to 22 pretty handily. Let's see if that was enough to get to 22. Twenty three, let's trim off a little more. All right, let's see if that was successful. Good enough. It's a little over twenty two, but that's fine. That's better than what it was. All right. So now let's get that guy the soup. that going and where's the soup I just made him right here 22 tomatoes worth of soup just for you bud you're lucky you're like right here you made that soup yet thank you god damn <clears throat> I gotta run back up there and grab the Super Bowl because <laughs> you treated like a freaking Lonely Island skid and just threw that shit on the ground. <laughs> I would almost, I would almost rather them consume the bowl instead of just like slurp up the soup and throw it back at you because then you gotta haul it around. All right, well. I'm just gonna cut the rest of these up. Mm. 
Yeah, it'd be much nicer when we have a way to automatically cut all these. Oh, that's gonna involve conveyor belts and stuff, which we're a little shy on. For if we, if we focused a lot of resources, we could absolutely get that kind of stuff, but... I would like a sprinkler or something first to kind of automate the watering kind of situation a little bit better. My, how to get over there? <laughs> Princess Tomato and Shambles. Let's combine all of our tomato chunks into one big homunculus. In the meantime, all of our little plants are growing nice and happy. Let's um, take a gander. All right. Doesn't appear like there's anyone that wants to do quests right now. That's fun. I sure do love that. <clears throat> I would assume that'd just be kind of around. Hmm. Well, I guess we can kind of just cut these carrots then. Easily, pretty handily. Carrots seem like they're doing fine too. Uh. <clears throat> I guess I need to be checking every once in a while to see if any quests are pop. Okay, there. Are, there's one in Burnscroft, and there's one in Bridgepore. And then one up near Ice Helm in a really awkward spot. Well, let's run over to Burns Croft, grab that one. Uh. <clears throat> My sinuses aren't quite as bad as yesterday, but they still kind of suck. Hey, you want blood? as well so let's go pay a biz a, a biz a visit a visit Jesus I forgot to change the driving in this game so it just feels a little different it's probably overall better but it's just like hmm, like it's not as slippery and slidey Alright, which one of you is once the fucking... Don't mind me. I'm just mooching about. Hey, you want blood? A cable never forget. What the fuck does that even mean? You. 
I wonder if eventually there are gonna be uh, jobs that request like swords or whatever as well. Okay, and then there's the one up there by Ice Helm. <clears throat> Might as well go check it out. see where they are in comparison to where I am. Looks like they're like up here somewhere. <clears throat> Maybe. <laughs> where the hell is this person? Hmm. This one doesn't seem like it'd be, it's worth my time trying to even get to the person because they're just like hiking in the mountains and then they want a freshly made bowl of soup. <clears throat> hmm. Let's take another look. That or they're in Ice Helm. What you mean? I can't see anyone out here, so they might actually be down in Ice Helm. <clears throat> Either way, it doesn't really feel like it's worth it in my current in my just current juncture to do anything about that, because. We're still based out of Ember Cradle, so things are a little slow to get around to. And I don't have time to just be driving, <laughs> driving to Ice Helm randomly and trying to, like, find this, like, mystery shopper. <clears throat> there's, soup, there's, there's plants to be grown and soup to be made. Come on, don't get stuck on the rocks, please. I'd say two out of three is pretty good anyway. All right, so we got fourteen cut tomato. I'm almost 90% sure is the one that was close. Alright, so let's do the 14 cut tomato one first. <clears throat> How much do we have left over here? 60? That does not look like 60. God damn. <laughs> we have here if it's a little over 14 I'm not gonna be that it's 15 you know that's mm. I could shave off like point one 
do a lot of like effort. But there's only got so much you can really shave off before you just don't have enough to where you can shave it off anymore. Yeah, we're we're just gonna have to uh deal with them having a 15 soup instead of a 14. I'm sure they'll survive. One, this one wants nine carrot and seven tomato. Okay, well, let's see how much tomato is here. That might already be enough. That's 30. That's more than enough. How much is this? 15. We can probably split that in half and call it good. seven or so 7.5 good enough okay so 7.5 where's the guy again and then we need a nine carat Point seven three. Six point three one. I don't like having to do soup math. That's nine, good enough. All right, so we'll put you in there. <laughs> Very awkwardly. Let's put you in here. Up. Oh, where the hell am I going? Okay, and then soup. Well, it looks like our crops are done, so we need to attend to them before we, uh... Now, did all the tomatoes grow? Huh. Might have been some, like, weirdness with, uh, just, I don't know, it might have just been some weirdness with, um... The, just, maybe the game was being weird previously, because, like, there was, like, some plants that just wouldn't grow on this area over here, so that's why I picked tomatoes to grow here, because tomatoes are uh, a lot faster to grow. up all our tomatoes. <laughs> Just a pile of tomatoes on the ground. <laughs> so we already got, we already have a uh, eight seeds over here, so we'd only need like 12 more, so let's get like eight of these. Turn those to seeds, and if that's not enough seeds, then we'll make some more. Is that like just enough seeds? I think that's literally, yeah, it's literally, um, I think that means that's roughly a 50-50 chance of getting two or one, so, 
I think on average, if you, like, say you need, like, ten seeds, you do, like, seven tomatoes, and that'll get you roughly ten seeds. Maybe a bit more, but, I mean, at the end of the day, if you, more seeds is never really a bad thing, per se. Proceed. Alright, and then I'll have the tomatoes proceed to... the chopping zone. Alright, now we gotta try to rustle some of these out of their slumber. And one way you could do it is you could get rid of the dig spot, but that's tedious because then you have to put it back to grow more. Try to grab the carrots. Some of them are just still stubbornly in the ground. Good morning, Diddy Dragons. Nice seeing ya. Hope you're doing well this morning, or afternoon rather, in your case, I guess. We have expanded to uh, 40 digging spots, and we've been doing some, we got some soup ready for people, but I wanted to get more crops planted before we run around delivering soup. The soup never ends. I think that goes there. Alright, and. We just got a big jumble of carrots over here. Okay. So now I need 20 carrot seeds to fill this, the field back up. So let's get a little bucket here and let's get like 14 and we'll turn them into seeds. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I well, that's it. That's fair. Yeah. Are you and Ghostly playing this again together on co-op? seed pack. You are one. Yeah, that's good. I'm glad, I'm glad y'all are enjoying it. Alright, so yeah, it does seem like it's a uh, roughly a 50% gain give or take from your when you make more seeds with the seed mill here because I put 14 in and I got 21 seeds out so we now have enough seeds here to 
replant. <laughs> right? Yeah, I, yeah. I, I wish these these dots are cool and fit the little minim, the minimalistic kind of like style. But I, I wish there was numbers, cause I have to like turn my head like a German Shepherd to like read the, the seed bag freaking numbers. <laughs> All right. Well, these carrots get to just kind of vibe for right now, because we got uh, 15 to me. I think that person was. Yeah, it's. Yeah. It, it is kind of satisfying, to, like, when you're making more of the drills or whatever, it just goes like big old clank, chunk, and just stuff like that. Yeah. One thing I did find that made it easier on me is, um, like, like near the big forge thing in Ice Helm, there's that, like, that kind of, like, tube system that actually is really useful for just, like, dropping off stuff you've made and then putting it in your truck and without having to, like, clutter everything. Hey there. It, that's helped me quite a bit in the past to like not lose my damn mind well there you go Thank you. fucker <laughs> don't mind me I'm just mooching about I'm sure you are <laughs> Personally, I have not done digging in Ice Helm before, just because it, it seems like it's kind of like a weird size and like it's kind of like awkward to go to a jeweler, but I can imagine it's useful for like doing weird projects. Like just like really strange like kind of things, maybe. Jump over the pile of carrots, turn the ball. Merge our tokens together. I, I, I said merge our tokens together. Okay, we have 1,036 so far. Alright, uh, let's look at our little map. There are currently no other new quests yet. I don't exactly know when or how they generate the quests. Oh, oh, there is, there's that one I have on the near the shore of Bridgeport that we're turning in now. With I wanted uh, this one. Yup, that's that's how you kind of have to start doing stuff. Is you gotta like, just kind of. Start start with iron because you can get so much iron like really fast like just like even like a setup of, of in this place with like ten diggers Well, like Yeah, it, it's it's a very set. This is a very satisfying game to watch stuff like that happen in um, So shovel down here probably Let's, I'm gonna get all my stuff out of the this tunnel here, and we're, I'm just gonna fill in the, the surface layer with dirt. Because at some point I might be buying that farming farming machine, and I don't want to like have it like fall into the ditch <laughs> when I'm trying to drive it around. I'm just kind of seeing how far I can really push the farming aspect of this game. Cause I've done I've done the digging part so many times at this point. Let's 
so we're just, we're just gonna cover up our little Mariana trench here. Mariana sends her regards. Wait, where, where'd that dirt just go? And we got plants growing anyway, so it's like, mm. Actually, you know, that's a good that's a good point. I, I probably need to buy that rake. Cause yeah, this is while it would be very funny just to kinda like do this, the rake would probably make things a lot less painful. Do I have that other soup to deliver still? Cause that one's in Bridgeport, so I could try to like go and buy a rake. What? Well, that's pretty sweet. Woo! I thought you just had, I guess that works with stuff that's not like placeables. Oh, that's fucking sick. I say as I utterly fail at putting that in the freaking <laughs> fuck my life. Uh, anyway, we gotta go to Bridgeport, so let's see about buying that, buying a rake. If I have enough money left, that is. Uh, I don't know if that's enough. We might need to make some soup and sell it real fast. Let's see, how much tomato is this? We're about to have like more. That is 30 pounds of tomato, perfect. Into the bin. How about this? I don't, I don't know if I really care how much is in here. Go, just go. I need, I need money. Press control and rotate, oh, okay. I'll, I'll, have to, I'll have to mess around with it because I'm just so used to just kind of raw dog and item placement in this game because it's sometimes is a little um interesting to say the least all right let's run up and sell this soup <laughs> we've become we've become the local soup kitchen for for weird farm people that are very hungry Alright, that should definitely be enough now for uh, a rake. Yeah. And I'll be quite honest, my depth perception is like dog shit on a good day, so. <laughs> I usually just kind of have to wing it. Like, my depth perception is not like completely like awful but it's not very good either <laughs> like a solid four out of ten I would say all right let's go deliver this
Yeah, th this game's got some interesting uh, quirks about it, to say the least. Um, actually, you know, uh, we're gonna just like drive as far as this, as the game will allow me to drive. Oh, he's right here. <laughs> Let's see, I'm gonna have to go like drive into the ocean. Let's go park my big ass truck on this hill very really awkwardly. I'm sure it is. He like says mid slurp, I sure am hungry. <laughs> I mean, to, if we're gonna be honest, the, the physics engine is just iffy in general. Not, not nothing. No disrespect to the game or the maker. They just physics hard. But like, yeah, like I think one of my first streams, I had the, the thing where like if you like, I put the bucket down just the wrong way and it like ascended to the heavens. <laughs> so yeah, like it's it's physics is a hard problem to solve on a good day. I think I can buy a rake here, maybe. Yeah, I probably can just buy that rake, and that'll probably be enough. Ugh. Give me this rake. And I actually don't have one of these yet either, so that'd be kind of nice to have. And I saw, I saw, I thought I saw somebody that wanted a uh, a bowl of soup somewhere nearby. Let's see. Up oh, there's someone nearby, and there's someone on the way to. Um... To South Hope, it looks like. Oh, I'm not surprised to hear that one. Where did all these? I did, did I like run right past them? I apparently I did. Is it, is it you? Are you the soup fucker? Are you the soup man? Spoon man. <laughs> Where are you? Soup. Come on, Uganda. It's you. Go do with some scrap. All right, cool. Huh. All right. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that to actually lead anywhere. Yeah, the pans might just... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we got another person. If I take a left, to be in the little kind of cottage or castle or whatever. Not this way. Now I've just got Spoon Man in my fucking head. Fucking sound garden. Spoon Man! <laughs> it's fitting, Spoon Man would be very effective in this soup based world. Oh, you want stuff that I don't have. I have corn. But that's. Ooh. Beetroot and corn. I have corn seeds already, so. Whenever, when we do crop rotation, I might have to spend some on some beetroot. Uh, let's head back and plan our next attack. Woo! The dri they changed the driving. I'm still getting used to it. It's, like, kind of sluggish. But has, like, acceleration. Like, the more you hold down, like, the key or whatever, it'll, like turn more and more I think I, I I think I almost preferred it when it was more slippery oh, Jesus Christ how did I manage that oh yeah I play this on keyboard or no way in hell I'm using controller in this game Alright, 
So this is the one that needs that one's beetroot and corn. Okay. Thankfully, all this stuff is ready to go, so we can just like amass an even bigger pile of carrots. And once I can flatten this out, I can expand the farm out to be another 20, so I can still grow one of these two while growing the other thing. So let's focus on that. So I'm going to have to get creative here and uh, kind of like do something like this, I guess? I don't know. I've never really played around with the rake much, so it's going to be a learning experience. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, that just deleted all the dirt I just placed there. if I understand how this works yeah I just keep deleting the dirt I keep trying to place Doesn't want to work there. What? Why? Huh? Why does it not specifically want to work? Like, what is going on? What in the? F what? <laughs> what is that? Oh, not enough dirt. Hmm. Fair enough. Still not fully sure how I'm gonna use this to kind of do this. It might just be it might have just been faster to do it this way. But let's we'll worry about that in a second. I gotta get the I gotta go buy a beetroot seed or so. Apparently. Fine. Get out of the truck. Jerk ass coins. <laughs> God damn it. Do what you're supposed to do, please. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Thank you, God. Why is it so hard sometimes for the game to do what it's supposed to do? <laughs> Thankfully it's only like a mild annoyance sometimes. Well, let's see what it wants to do now. I feel there's not enough dirt there, so I'm, I would have to dig up and kind of fill in the area. I guess the goal is to get to where it's doing this so that you can get like a completely like flat like thing of dirt. Hmm. 
I don't want to do that because that will like clear out all that dirt I just was digging around with. I'm confused and how the what this rake's even supposed to be doing right now because like it's uh, not working how I would think it would. And like this is like chiefly why I've just never used this thing because I've never been able to get to actually do what it's supposed to do. <laughs> like I just need this top area filled in. It's like. At this point, I might as well just flat every, flatten everything and put blocks in because I just can't be bothered. But, I oh don't know. I guess the only thing I can really do is just keep adding more dirt until it decides that it wants to do what it's supposed to do. Yeah, I'm, I'm just as I'm just as confused as you are. <laughs> It's literally faster for me just to shovel dirt over it and call it good than whatever the hell I'm trying to do now. So I'm just going to do that. It lets me flatten whatever mess I've made, so I guess that's good enough. <laughs> Still kind of ugly, but there's not much I can really do about that. I think I think is not press E and drop it again. Uh. Hmm, okay. Oh, let's see. So these need to be filled up. It's just kind of a little hard to kind of tell, honestly, where I still need to put stuff at. You know what? It's good enough. It's I'm I'm over it. Honestly, I just want to not fall into the abyss if I get that 
farming machine and drive it, try to drive it around and just like fall into a ditch and have to freaking reset every like five seconds. The roller machine's kind of like a more um, elaborate uh, rake. I've played around with it a little bit on the other file I have that has like normal mining stuff. It's kind of cool, but it seems a little um, inconsistent sometimes. Like sometimes it just won't flatten anything, but then sometimes it will. It's just, yeah, yeah, absolutely. I've, I've tried it. And it's like, well, it works sometimes, and sometimes it's just like, no. Nope. You don't, you don't get a birthday this year. It's like, oh. All right, well, let's, let's see if the rake wants to cooperate now. I don't know what changed. It seems like it's working like I was wanting it to now, this time. I don't know what I did differently. <laughs> You know what? Whatever. I, the hole's the hole's gone. That's kind of the point. So now I can add more, uh, add another like twenty or so things. But I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to do some. Uh, I need to go buy that beetroot seed because I don't have any, and I'm gonna need to have those going so I can kind of get those propagating. Where's my? My, uh, core. Did I put them in the truck already? Do we have any? No, oh, I think we already have those three quests anyway. Five cut tomato, five carrot. Uh, I might as well do this one since it's. I have to go back that way anyway. That's fair. I I I was just kind of go. I was just kind of frustrated and just throwing dirt up there. So maybe that's what I have to actually do instead of trying to be like precise. <laughs> there's there's no winning in this game. It's just you're just like up. Oh, it's gonna work. Nope. Now you're frustrated. And you're doing it wrong on purpose. And nope. Now it works. Okay. Cool. <laughs> All right. So um, five tomato, five carrot. There's my little chopper. I already have the carrot right here. Actually, let's see. Is that five? That's three. This might be five. It's six. Don't care. That's what we're using. I... Yeah, I, I noticed that pretty early when trying to like just dig out the entirety of this area to kind of put in machines. It's like there's like that wall on the side that you can't dig into. It kind of just gets in the way and it's kind of annoying. Because a lot of times you can't even place like blocks to kind of flatten it out. It's just like you basically cover it up and forget about it until something breaks and then you go down there and try to fix it. <laughs> I think this was the six. Yeah. I could try to separate this out even more. There's only so much you can trim off from the, from this before you are too, too trimmed. This is at least no. It's it's a little less. Okay, that was beetroot. It's five tomato. All right, well let's cut some tomatoes. One, two, three. Let's see how much <laughs> this is. If it's at least five. We're going with it. We need to cut one more. Then we can play ball.
you can change the color of the drop dot. That's interesting. It might be useful if like something if it keeps blending in with something you're working on and you need it to like not do that. I suppose. Alright, let's that in there. I like how I bought this water cane specifically to put water in this in the pot. Ah, I see. That's fair. All right, so this is the soup for one of the people in Bridgeport, I believe. I'm, I'm guessing that'd be an option somewhere, which is cool. It's, it's nice that they have, they're adding more stuff like that to the game. Our tomatoes. Yeah, I'm a hundred percent like buying the farming machine when I get enough coins for it, because that's probably the more more tedious part of the thing is get, getting rid of the old plant so you can actually just get at the thing. But the farming machine does that when you just roll over plants anyway. I think. Comrade Sickle. Let's scoop up all these tomatoes. I'm just amassing an army of tomatoes. I'm just so used to people wanting tomatoes for their soups that I just make lots of tomatoes. Let's get like 14 of these little bastards. Make seeds. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and fourteen. Should have gotten us 21 seeds. Yep, it did. So that got us the seeds we need to replant. 20 potatoes. Not potatoes. Tomatoes. One of those toes. And then the rest can get kind of just dragged in the pile with the rest of them. Okay, and then we'll do the same with the carrots. Drag, we'll drag whatever carrots will come with us over, because some of them need plucked out of the ground very gingerly. I'm just going to drag them up here. is 
nine. So I think I think we have an extra carrot seed. So I think that'd be twenty now. Again, I'm turning my head like a freaking like dog. See that sees a tasty snack. Just fucking read these dots. Cause you can't see the ones on the top, and like it's kind of like awkward for my brain to process counting them vertically at an angle like that. Okay, so we do have twenty of each. Okay. Uh, I think we got like a good amount of corn, but not like exactly twenty. One, two, three, four, five. We have like. 19 corn so let's get the rest of the carrots out of the ground we'll plant the corn and we're we'll gonna get those beetroots Magnetic carrots are my favorite kind. Make sh let's actually plant this corn now that I've got the carrots out of the ground. All right, corn is planted. We need to grab our tokens if we don't have them with us. I think we do have them in here though. Yeah, we do. Because we're going to have to buy at least one beetroot. I might, depending on how many tokens it costs, I might buy two just to kind of get them up and running. Because we're going to have to grow them, turn them to seeds and grow them again before we can start getting enough to kind of turn into soup reliably. I think the jerk off that one of the uh, soup here is back here. Fetch me some scran. I just Thanks. did. I'm well chuffed. So much plant. Uh, yeah. Tis the plant life. They're, ex they're extremely northern. Well, they just like side shimmied to sit so on the bench. <laughs> well, let's see. We got anyone else in Bridgeport at once? Oh, that one, one motherfucker over here wants some more soup. So let's grab your order while I'm here. Might as well. <clears throat> Those lights can be all sorts. Colors. <laughs> Just gonna want some more. Some you want broccoli? You want broccoli? Well, I suppose I can buy broccoli and slowly just kind of build it up in the background. Ooh, apply a little logic. The, the light can be any color you want as long as it's <laughs> red, green, and blue. <laughs> As long as it's one of the three specific colors. I just realized how, like, not full my truck's water tank is right now. I mean, I don't think it's, like, halfway empty, but... Because I think there's, like, a light on the side that flashes when it is, but... I'm just, like, I can actually see the emptiness. So it's probably time to fill it up when I get back. 
Alright. There it is, the 99 extra coins, 1291. Logic can be very useful in my other file. Actually, I can just show you real quick. In my other file, I have uh, Logic set up to auto repairs uh, the filters for water. So let me go to my. I'll go to my menu and I'll show that real quick because it took me a, a a minute to look up and figure out how to get it to actually work. Because there's nobody gives any concise tutorials about anything ever for anything ever. <laughs> So it was a combination of me, like, piecing together bits and pieces from Reddit posts and shit to finally get it to work to where I can understand it. Come on, game. It's fine. I promise. <sighs> Like I was saying earlier, I'm also currently um, uploading some VODs to YouTube, <laughs> so my computer's probably not super happy with me right now, but, you know, it's whatever. We'll just have to sit tight. I had a pretty large backlog of VODs I needed to upload just for preservation's sake, like... Uh, for my PC, I record things locally because uh, sometimes... Well, at least in the past, I had a lot more connection issues than I did now. So recording things locally made sure I actually got all of what was, you know, recorded or or played. Like, even if the, the if Comcast decided to just shit its pants. So now we're just sitting here, waiting. Do, 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 do. There we go. <clears throat> That's true. I did I did use that in the past, but I was running into issues with uh, one forgetting to do that and then possibly <clears throat> losing vods, which I don't want to happen because my 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 brain is applesauce and it's very thinly spread applesauce at that. So. <laughs> <clears throat> Yeah, it's mostly just, it's mostly a me problem, so that's also why I started like recording uh, things. Is I can upload that on my, on my time, and the problem became I kept putting it off. You, that's a very good point, and I would love to do that, but my brain sometimes doesn't really want to do that for whatever reason. Yeah, I'll load up my uh, other, my other world. I'm gonna have to immediately like void out like resources because I think the. Uh, yeah, this is... This got a little backed up with the update. <laughs> As you might be able to see, so... I might have to, uh... We're gonna, like... So we're not, we're not turning this thing on for a while. But yeah, I can show you, like, at least this system I have up here. I also have, like... I kidded this place the fuck out. I got like a little dirt journey for all this to go on. But yeah, I can show this off here because these are uh, durability readers. Oh no, yeah, these are uh, no, these are um, spanner hurlers or whatever. Those are durability readers, and they read the durability of this filter. And I have. Let's, let's kind of get over here. We have some of these uh, greater th greater than or equal twos. So when this durability reader reads the durability of this, 
the reason the derivative of this is greater or equal to this, or when this is greater than or equal to this, it sends a signal and it repairs it. And this constantly outputs a signal of one. So when this gets to one durability, it gets repaired automatically. Probably the single-handedly most useful fucking thing I've ever put together in this game is just this. Oop. It, it makes a lot more sense when it's actually explained by somebody. <laughs> yeah, like you can, like you fill this thing up with like however I think it's twenty, and that shit can run for hours without you needing to even look at it. As you can see, we've got a, we've got a few things in here. It's very <laughs> these fucking gems. It's I can't even remember what happened. Just like <laughs> there's just so many. <laughs> <coughs> now I also have this down here too. Yeah, I can't, I I think it's, I think it's because um the this the, they updated this to be different, and this was full of gems, so the gems escaped containment. Like if we just do, uh oh, uh oh, that was a mistake. I might have just crashed the game. <laughs> Why did I think that was a good idea? <laughs> God. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, oh, oh. We're, we're moving at like point zero frames per second. <laughs> ah. Well, that might explain it. Yeah, I used to be able to just like fill it up with all the kinds of gems and just like... Yeah, they got... Yeah, um... Yeah... Oh! <laughs> I think I might have literally crashed the game. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, those might be going all over the place if the game recovers from this setback. I think there's a mod that lets you delete gems like this too, so that might be something I have to install and like use, cause like, there's way too many for me to like rely, like clean up in a meaningful time period. Oh, 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 no, gems are, gems are processed, so I, it, they won't go away when you do that one thing. Uh, it's trying very hard. I was hoping it would go away like that, but like, <laughs> this poor game is struggling. <laughs> God. Well. You can just hear the nice crickling, crackling of the light posts, I guess. Come on, game. Come on. Come on. Okay. Maybe. We might we might be able to escape. I was thinking it was this clear raw resource and it has a gym there, but like it didn't clear out the gyms. <laughs> Oh, jeez. <clears throat> well, I guess I'll drink my coffee a little bit while suffering begins anew. <laughs> it's trying so hard to process. Cause it, prob it probably moved the gems and then it, it processed me moving away. It's just like really, it's struggling. <clears throat> Come on. I'm having way more patience with this than I probably really even need to really be having because this is like, yeah. Uh, uh, come on. Uh, 
if I can guarantee the game would actually load back up pretty quickly, I would just close it out. I might just do that anyway. I don't know. I don't want to, like, corrupt my freaking game file. But then again, if it really comes to it, I'll just, like, make a different one. So, screw it. <clears throat> yeah, we'll just, <laughs> we'll just open it again and hope it decides it wants to, like, work better this time. Then again, that was my fault. I shouldn't have done that. I should have known better from, like, the last time I tried doing that. <clears throat> so, if that, so if, in, in that case, that means you're going to need, like, four separate, like, gym compressors in that case, I guess. I don't know. That seems like a, uh, a step backwards in um, quality of life. Like why why is it why was that necessary? Don't exactly know why that it was a problem that you could just compress all gems together. Cause it, it still kept all the gems separate, like sapphires would blend with sapphires. It wouldn't look like Weird hybrids or anything like that. Although that would be really cool if it did. But, yeah, it's just kind of seems like a weird design choice that probably broke a lot of people's stuff when they updated. Like, it broke mine. Alright, game. I gotta wait for this to load back up. Might as well just look at Twitter or something because it's going to take a It's going to take a sec. Do <clears throat> <laughs> There we go. Okay, it didn't take as long as I thought it was going to, so. We're gonna go back to the farming sim world and not touch stream world ever again. At least not on stream. All right, <clears throat> so. Uh, now that that tangent's over with, uh, let's see. I think we need a beetroot. Oh, 430, that's. See, I wanted to do a uh, so much. Ugh. Well, I might as well just buy these seeds and get it get it over with. The way I don't have to buy them ever again. And then all the all the extra coins or tokens or whatever I have can go towards things I want. <clears throat> yeah hate having to spend all this on you know this stuff but but at least we can start getting these going all right well let's uh continue to suffer because I, I just spent like all of our guild tokens basically on seeds. Granted, those seeds will be able to duplicate to, to more plants. It's just going to take a minute to actually get them going. Which sucks. Because I was hoping uh, I was hoping to have a... Um... <laughs> Holy shit! I was hoping to, to have like a sprinkler or the farming machine by the, by the end of today's stream. But that's definitely not happening now with me having to grow these plants like this 
Well, at the very least, next stream will probably be a lot more conducive to doing that stuff because. <laughs> That's amazing. I love, I love the kickball kicking sound that they make whenever they get hit by the truck. All right, all right, onion, get in the fucking ground. And broccoli and beetroot and then we'll do the rest as uh, tomatoes I guess because what the hell else are we gonna do All that crap planted. Let's see, this one wants that's the beetroot and corn. This one wants broccoli. And we only got two quests, and those are it. So, yeah. And I guess the other thing we could work on is getting another set of plants going so let's make some let's make some honestly carrot soup at this point no, I would make tomato because tomatoes are very easy to get quickly because well they grow faster than anything else that's not how we cut things <laughs> we have so far 18 I mean I have no qualms about literally cutting up all these tomatoes and just making a mega mega bowl of soup soup's on slurp How much are we up to now? 41? I can go even higher. Yeah, I'm just gonna cut the rest of these. They surely have more tomatoes than that. I think I have like 80 something tomatoes. 82. 82 pounds of tomatoes right now. That's a, that's a few. That's a few tomatoes. Like, that'll, that'll get us a little bit of money. I think I'll combine those carrots that we have there as well just to make as much soup as possible. And I think adding, I think multiple things of in a soup make them more worth money anyway worth more money I can't even talk so I'm still just a little annoyed at uh -huh. the, at the gym thing on my other file just basically hosing my entire uh, 
setup. It's not. It's not very. Uh, was not very nice of it to do that. All right. Well, let's see how much this soup sells for, because we need money direly. Especially if I want to get stuff like conveyor belts or anything like that. Although our first objective is going to be getting more uh, pipes. So that we can grow more stuff at a time. Because that's going to be our, like, our limiting thing is that just growing more stuff at a time is going to be absolutely essential. So we need like two of you. Thanks for your business. Don't mind me. I'm just mooching about. where this gets us and if we need more pipes we'll just come back because I don't I don't want to buy too many and miscalculate and then have like just a bunch of extra pipes doing no good as it is once we get a sprinkler we're gonna have have a much more uh, much less need for pipes anyway so it's like mm. So I do need a um, another straight pipe. Let's go buy that since that's the only one of those I need. Looking for something. As they say, if, if if you're trying to do something and brute force isn't working, you must not you might not be using enough brute force, and that's kind of the idea behind this. Is just without sprinklers, you gotta gotta water things somehow, and this <laughs> this is the way to do it. For better, or for worse. So I need one, two, three, four, five, six more of those. Six more T pipes, and then we will be f have another twenty plants. <laughs> that's so many plants. But that's fine. This is just 
stuff we're doing while waiting for stuff to grow anyway, so we're not really wasting time. I think it said it needs six. If you want to get in the... Oh, that dude is having a problem. I hope I have enough money for it. 285. Okay, we do, it looks like. All right. Three, four, five, and six. We got all those dug out. They're all perfectly hydrated. Those grow really slow, I'm guessing. So they're just going to take a bit longer. Thankfully, the corn is extremely easy for us to actually um, harvest because it's it's just tall. Let's move the carrots out of the way because I don't have to worry about them you know, being in the way, <laughs> I guess. Yeah, we're holding on to the carrots because unlike these, unlike these tomatoes, they take longer to grow by uh, un enough of uh, enough to be annoying, rather. Here's hoping that these plants give me more than one thing per uh, harvest, like more than one uh, like actual like broccoli or onion or whatever, because otherwise it's gonna be real slow. At this point, I'm just gonna turn all these into tomato seeds. So now you, you just don't want to be magnetic anymore. All right, sure, cool, whatever. Since the soups I have now don't even really want tomato, I'm just gonna make a bunch of these, make a bunch of seeds so I don't have to worry about it. Okay, so if my math math is going correctly, so far we've got at least like 40 seeds, if not more. Four, five. Oh, 
I'm sorry, make that 50 tomato seeds. All right. Like 57. 57 tomato seeds. All right, cool. Okay, looks like these are still actually growing properly. I was afraid that there would be a, some weirdness going on, but no, they're doing fine. It's corn. All right. No, <clears throat> oh, one of those must not have grown because, yeah, there's just a corn bit there. I know I need at least eight corn for this uh, soup that they want us to do, so we're gonna get that and then the rest are gonna get turned to seeds. Maybe, we'll see. All right, that's enough for that. So we'll put that corn over there. Grab one of our various pans and just start Corn in there. is like awkward to put in this thing you think it wouldn't be but it it sure is come on game be gentle just save and let me continue playing please thank you I think that means I have 60 tomato seeds, which is a little silly, honestly. Get out of the water. I know you want to grow, but you're not going to You're very excited to grow. Uh, let's see. Okay, that should be 20 corn there as well. 24 corn. 20 corn. Let's say 24. Uh, which means the rest of this corn can kind of just hang out in case we need it for other stuff. So let's, uh, let's drag the carrots further and further away from the light. I'm just going to have various piles of, of vegetables. Oh, we also have this corn seed over here, too. OK, 
Okay, so we got 25 corn seeds. Still waiting on these to kind of finish. Because they do take a minute. They, they take a while, so we kind of want to prioritize those. Being said, I don't. I really don't mind planting just a bunch of this corn. I just like not dig little things in these places where there's water drop. Am I just blind? Am I blind? I maybe. <laughs> um, that or I just need to use the rake to kind of flatten some dirt. Oh, I see an onion. Okay, I, did, I wasn't totally losing, totally losing my entire mind. It was a case of uh, dirt being a little uh, high. We got it. We got at least two onions, so that's good. So we're gonna turn these into seeds and hopefully get at least more than two seeds. Well, there's one. Although, frankly, we started with one onion plant, so getting two back is at least already double. Okay, we can work with that. Oh, these take so long to grow though. Oh, hello. What do you want? Fetch me some scrum. No oh, well, that's gonna have to wait. <laughs> I don't have enough onions yet to do anything with that. Broccoli. We got like three broccoli. Here's to hoping we get like some more seeds. Get in the thing. Oh yeah, we already we started the one broccoli seed. We already got like at least three. The broccoli is probably gonna have no problems. At this point, 
Oh yeah, we got like five broccoli seeds. Is this still growing? I think beetroot was, was, was the most expensive by a, a wide margin, so probably has the, the longest grow time as well. Ugh. Did I plant like some corn or something? Why do I have only like... I thought I had more corn seeds. Thought I had like 25 of them. Did I plant some and then like just like lose them somewhere? What the hell did I do? <laughs> it's not like they're not just like in the water somewhere, are they? Hmm. Or maybe I just am really bad at counting. Holy hell, grow! <laughs> hmm. I think I'm just really bad at this whole counting thing. Oh, wait. How did you get there? <laughs> what? How did just corn seeds randomly get underground? Just gonna plant a bunch of corn at this point. And we'll tidy up the uh, the, the area. As we patiently wait for this fucking beetroot to grow. Oh, it happened. Just a. You see, you just gotta complain a little bit. Well, we got at least two. That's good. I was really hoping we'd get more than that, but. You know what? That's fine. We, we, we tripled our investment of farm tokens or whatever. That one needs nine cut onion. That one needs beetroot and corn. Did we have another one in here as well? Two broccoli. Yeah, that's gonna have to wait too because broccoli is currently growing. Well, I guess at this point, we're going to just cut up all this corn. And make some soup to get some money, I guess. Kind of in an awkward spot where like every, they all they want is stuff from new plants that we don't have like grown up yet. Okay, we got corn, tomatoes, and then the new plants. OK, 
Okay, we only have one thing that asks for corn here, I believe. Yeah, only one of these needs corn. So this corn is gonna go and turn into a soup and get sold for money, because I want to get some money. Corn slop. y'all are having a nice day I'm doing all right not as sinusy and dead as feeling as yesterday Ugh. but that remains to be seen I suppose and this corn is 24.9 of corn let's go see yeah getting the, the faster cart would be nice Mmm, corn soup. Yep, I've got I've, I've got the uh, the beetroots, the onions, and the broccoli all growing, and I they finally all grew their first uh, plant, and thankfully they all gave me multiples instead of just one, so we can start propagating more and more. So right now I'm just taking this extra corn I had. Not you're not corn, you're corn, and trying to get some money. That wasn't as much as I was hoping it would be, but that's okay. That's still more than what we had. Oh, don't get stuck in the, the landscape. I probably should just be fishing with the spare time. But we'll see. We'll see if I end up just doing some fishing while waiting for all this stuff to grow. I also had another uh, 20... Um, Growing spots because I, I just need the more the growing spaces like sorely. Okay, we got some money. I'm suspecting I just like left all of my uh, I fought my remaining farm guild tokens at the farm guild I was like probably just kind of annoyed that I had to spend all almost all my tokens on seeds but those seeds are currently making more seeds so yeah I guess we'll fish See a little fish rolling around in there. Come on, get out of the drink.
frankly surprised there's not like fish soup. Is that the fish I need for the uh, better rod? It looks weird, so may I'll go try it out. Looks like it's been dropped a few times. <laughs> Same. Oh, they want a crab. Well, we can't give them our crab, so we're gonna have to catch a different crab. That being said, I know where I caught that other crab. I, it was in this little river here. Don't know if that's. Maybe I can just catch it in this spot. Anyway. Yeah, I'm surprised they don't have fish soup. That, like, you could put, like, depending on what fish it is, it might hit maybe have, like, a certain weight when you chop it up or something. I'm sure there's a way they could figure out how to do it. Alright, well, this fishing pole can gonna go over here with the other one. It's no longer needed. Okay, tomatoes are growing, corn's growing, this stuff's growing pretty decently. Served on toast. Ugh. Doesn't sound super appetizing to me, but then again, I don't know. I like trash food anyway. Like, I'm very much a meat and potatoes kind of person, if, when possible. Old Slippy Grip. Oh, okay. Well, let's see if we get any different fish. See if I can catch the crab here. I mean, I caught a goddamn puffer fish. Be funny if I can get the fish automatically just drop in the bucket. Oh, actually, yeah, perfect. No cleanup afterwards. From river to pan in seconds. Sounds like some advertising thing, like a restaurant would say. It's like from river to pan, and it's like, it's like, you motherfuckers did not catch this fish yourself. Stanky boot. Well, we got a matching set. <laughs> Let's see. Corn's going good. These are doing fine. About as fine as they're going to really do. Tomatoes are already done, so we'll... We'll do that song and dance. Wherever my sickle is. How did I put my sickle? Oh, are you up here? Yeah. It matters not.
Now wherefore art thou magnet stick? You're right here. Oh no, the sad the saddest plants getting cut down in their prime. Good morning, Neki. <laughs> We are continuing. No, come back! Come back! <laughs> oh, don't you. You know what? Just for that, you get to get turned into a seed, fucker. It decided they wanted to roll. That song fills your heart with joy. <laughs> okay, it's six. Replant these. Oh boy! One. I will. I, I'm gonna. What are you having at the buffet? I will. Look, I will look like the. I'll look like the very dirt that I'm planting all these plants in. <laughs> Corn's coming along nicely. Oh, I got some other fish over here. <laughs> yeah, blinking. <laughs> Uncrafted product, fetch hefty prices. I'll take fish, veggies, and soup. Oh, you buy the boot too? Oh, I love me some huh? scran. Oh, fucking scran. <laughs> That even mean? I don't want to look it up. It's probably not very nice. Seven ninety, cool. Okay, corn is done. You are done too. All right. Got us five onions. Turn all of them into seeds. I think one of these did want some onion. Uh, nine, yeah, no, that's not happening yet. We gotta grow more. Oh, yeah, we got. 
for seven onions to plant. We had just two. Okay, now we gotta wait for these two things to grow. Well, the corn's all done. That's a lot of corn. It's kind of awkward to drag around, so we might as well just pick it up. Feels like I got a real bumper crop of corn this time, because like just there's so much of it. Gosh dang. That's so, I don't even know how much corn that is, but that's a lot of freaking corn. Five seeds there. We need at least 20 until I feel comfortable. Okay, well, there's 10 of them. There's two there. We got our seeds set back that we needed to spend to get all the corn to plant. Which means we just have <laughs> all of this fucking corn. Well, I guess this, bit, this little hands is give a place as I need to keep it. Oh yeah, here's the... I need to buy some more pans, actually. I'm going to be just kind of storing... Um, yeah, if I'm going to just be storing um, veggies in, veggies that I don't need yet in these pans, and yeah, I need more pans for that. You are correct. 
That is a correct statement. <clears throat> Corn is good in bread form. Cornbread is great. It can be great, rather. Yeah, you gotta boil it. Don't boil the butter. Oh, come on. Where's your sense of adventure? Um, I'd actually see if um, maybe those crate thingies I have could store uh, veggies. Like, let me see how much they cost. Because, like, there's this, this mod I have for, like, these crates. Oh damn, this might be a bit much. Who would want this? This is still useless. Starting to actually get somewhere. Why would you need such a big crate? Got evil plans? Now this is something beyond anything you will ever need. Uh, let's... Pretty sure we could probably get away with, uh... One of these godly crates. Let's try it. It might not even work for what I want it for. But we can just make the money back if it's really that big of a deal. If I could just do that to store my carrots, that'd be awesome. Because there's just a lot of carrots there. I'm guessing it doesn't work on these. No, it doesn't look like it does. No, that's fine. I, I'm sure I'll use it for something else eventually. <clears throat> but yeah, we'll just we'll just farm a near. Well, it's still the game's still hygienier, but. Um, we're doing stuff with uh, plants and soup, so it's more of like a soup making uh, cooking sim than anything now, because I've, I've done as little digging as I possibly can get away with. I've done fishing in a little bit of money, but most of it's come from growing stuff. It's like I'm playing Stardew Valley with a physics engine. <laughs> all right, and then all of our all of our carrots are there. All right, let's grab this other pan and we'll start. <laughs> Your place it used to be soup, and now it's anger. Pick some broccolis. sickle and we'll cut down the broccoli plants that are no long they are no longer in season because you, you pick from them and then they're dead this one doesn't seem like it's growing fully yet hmm it's weird. Maybe it's just taking longer for some reason than the other. Who beat the root? Very funny.
Ah, there it goes. It was just a little slower than its uh, brothers. Yeah, the beetroots take the longest to grow by a good bit. Okay. All right, so we got a good amount of beetroots now. We gotta turn all. We gotta turn all these into seeds. Oh well, I got like eleven broccoli seeds now. I'm stuck. I'm stuck in a bucket. <laughs> I, was, I was stuck in the bucket. Okay, yeah, we got. Yep, really? <laughs> it's just like mm, I don't think so. I don't think I really need to do deal with that right now. Oh, well, like, apparently I grabbed the one little baggie of seeds instead of the ten. Wonderful. All right, and those tomatoes, not tomatoes, those onions are growing, rather. All right. Beetroots, let's go! We're still kind of in, like, the phase of getting all these uh, newer crops propagated to multiples. I had to buy like one seed of beetroot, one seed of uh, broccoli, and one of onion because I just didn't have them yet. And so now we're still kind of getting them up in numbers. Being said, now can, we can plant like a, 11. Beetroots and get that going real nice. Because all my contracts I have over here need, like, that one wants onions, which you don't have enough yet. That one wants broccoli, which you probably could have done, but and that one wants beetroot and corn. We have the corn here. In the meantime, we've just got, like, endless quantities of tomatoes just showing up in our life. We need to start just getting them in their pan here. Okay, those are cleaned up. Let's get our sickle and free this tomatoes from their their mortal their mortal salt their mortal frame their mortal coil. Let's cut them straight off the vine. Cut the vine. They fall to the ground. Perfectly fine. Where, oh, where is my little rod gone? That's over here. <clears throat> I'll be glad when I have a sprinkle, I don't have to hear this dripping noise anymore because it's a little obnoxious. <clears throat> Frankly, I'm just gonna stockpile tomatoes until I run out of seeds. Come on. Get. Really? Christ. <laughs>
excuse me, what? <clears throat> that one bounced out of the freaking pan somehow? So what kind of soup do y'all like? I'm not usually a big soup fan, but I can appreciate a good chicken noodle. <clears throat> Tomato. Nice. <clears throat> Speaking of tomato, let's... Yeah, it's it's very much a case of I have to want soup or else it's just like, why am I doing this to myself? Because in the, the day, it's just, it's food water, which is fine, but sometimes I want like solid, like hearty food that fills me up instead of just like, you know, like runny tomato water, basically. <laughs> Okay, well that junk's all going. Let's take this pan and our fishing rod, wherever it may be. No, nope, I know we have a new fishing rod. Where did I leave it? Why I just have a stanky boat? I leave it over here. Okay. And I'll go fish over there because that's where I found the. See, they get the next rod, they're like, they want a crab, but we can't give up this crab. That's our, that cra crab is guarding our crystals. <laughs> so obviously we gotta go get another crab. <laughs> or at least try. Yeah, unfortunately, having having to spend a, mo the majority of our farming guild tokens on the new seeds kind of set me back to a point where I'm not super thrilled because we have to um, now rebuild up seed uh, tokens. But the good thing is though that one contract that needs beetroots and corn, that one alone is like 550 tokens. So I have a feeling things will be all right. It's just a matter of getting back up there, and that's going to be next stream. This is where I caught the uh, crab last time. So I figured I might as well come back here again. fish for a few more minutes and we'll go back and check on the uh, crops. Oh, there's a crab. Alright, well we're done here anyway. <clears throat> Now we can go upgrade to, I think, to a higher tier rod. I don't know what the higher tier rods actually do anything. Like, maybe they catch fish quicker or something? I don't know. I haven't really looked into the fishing before much. And there's the wikis aren't extremely helpful either way. placeholder 
Rank 4 pole, a bit slimy. Oh, this one's rank 3, so... <clears throat> Well, I guess let's see what our fish are worth. If this if the stock market for fish is here, and okay, it's not worth it to uh, sell it anywhere else other than. I mean, we can sell them right here too. It looks like there's a grocer, so we can sell our catch here and have the pan ready to go for next time. One of the next things I think I want to buy with like regular hydroneer money is the faster cart because it, it lets you move at run speed while carrying stuff around, which is pretty nice if you're like fishing like this. <clears throat> Don't mind me, I'm just mooching about. Overall fishing pole is just gonna go over here near the rock. <laughs> okay. Oh, I meant to grab the coin, not the cart. Okay. Come on. It's not the first time this stream I've had the board of money just didn't want to combine when it's supposed to. Uh, what what can you do though? The answer is not much. <laughs> all right, I think these are all the beetroots right here. And then we've got onion. <clears throat> I do have a pan. I need to buy more pans still. Yeah, let's just buy like four or five more pans so I can hold, uh, have one for fish and then have the other ones for, uh, have the other ones for just holding different, uh, vegetables or, or whatever Looking for some Hopefully, it was, hopefully some of these gives us more than one uh, onion, so we can keep expanding our the onion army. Raked the area before. It's weird that it's like. Maybe I forgot this particular area. I could have swore I did though.
Alright, well, that's fun. So all these um, onions should be ready to cut down and we could probably just replant new ones in their place. Well, so we, we had seven plants, and we got how many, many onions is in here, and we're going to turn those all into seeds. That's 20. We just went from, like, 7 to 20. <laughs> so, yeah, next next uh, time we're going to have a, a very uh, nice... We're going to stop growing tomatoes in this lane here. For now, at least, so we can propagate our more uh, important plants. Right, place that there. Let's grab our tomato pan and we'll start putting them in here. And once we can get the, uh, the the farming machine, it will like automatically like cut down the plants and pick, and collect all the the like tomatoes or whatever for us. So it get, it makes the farming process a lot less labor intensive. Which is why, as much as it sucks that we had to spend all of our tokens on these new plants, um, we don't have to do that ever again. And we can just save the rest of our stuff from new things of soup on more tokens. And depending on how tall the farm machine is, I might have to like raise these up by like one or two... Uh, blocks to make sure that we uh, don't have any problems with it getting like clearance issues get in the pan you shit Tomato, the, the tomato zone is now the onion zone. Okay. And beetroots are still growing. Broccoli still growing. I'm gonna move all my uh, veggie pails. Over here. Makes more sense to have them over here than elsewhere. Let's cut onion. Let's beetroot and corn. We already got the corn. This one is broccoli. Let's offload the rest of these pans. We, want, we do want to keep one with us. But with the last, like, two minutes or so of stream, I'm going to go to the, the... See if we can catch it. Yeah, I think it's a... Wait, do you want a quest, too? One corn? That's a very small amount that we could actually do, but... Eh. Next time. We'll worry about that next time. I want to see if I can catch this uh, swordfish and or marlin really quick. I'm going to assume it lives in the ocean. Then again, I also would have assumed the uh, pufferfish and crab would live in the ocean, but 
We caught those in, <laughs> in the river, in the rivers, so it's like, hmm. Is there any, like, method to the madness of where things live? There's another boot. <laughs> well, it is now 11, so I'll do this cast and then one more. And then we'll pack it up. We'll go back and s see what's going on with plants and probably end the stream there. Oh, oh I missed. We'll, we'll do another cast because I was distracted by, I don't know, my eye or something. I, I have no idea how I missed that one. Sometimes the brain just goes burr. Hey, you there. Doing some scrum. I wonder if just new uh, orders generate over time, whether you pick them up or not, so you can just like eventually have a lot of orders. Like, looks like Bastion Keep has one as well. Let's go grab that real quick before it despawns or whatever. One day I'll buy a shiny I assume there's only three or four orders available at a time, but there's like five things on the map right now, so. Oh wait, there's one you we already have I yours. Fine, whatever. <laughs> Fairly certain that the beetroots are probably close to done, if not already done growing, but we'll worry about them next time. Or well, either way, I just kinda wanna take a look. No, yeah, they're still growing. They take they take uh, a while. So if there's one plant I would probably would want to double down on at some point, just having a full field of them growing, it would probably be these, because they just take so long compared to like these, or these, or whatever. But yep, that will, that's going to do it for us today. We've made some good progress though. We got, some, we got the plants that we didn't have before, and we've got them kind of propagate. Oh, Bronkly. The broccoli's coming in nicely, but yeah, we're gonna save and we're going to save and quit the desktop. Alrighty, well, that is gonna be the stream for today. Thank y'all so much for coming by and hanging out. Thank you for lurkers. Y'all are amazing as well. I, if I don't say it often enough, lurkers are like the lifeblood of any like respectable Twitch streamer. To like, people that just come and hang out and put you on in the background, like, while you're, like, doing chores or something like that. MVP shit. Truly. Because I know I do that myself if, like, I'm doing stuff around the house or whatever. I'll put on, like, 
something on YouTube or maybe a Twitch streamer or something. And so anyone that does that for me, I really appreciate that. Uh, next stream is planned for Saturday. Uh, last Saturday, there was a different plan that ended up coming up. So I only did the morning stream, but I planned to stream a normal like three stage stream on Saturday where it's like one in the morning, one in the afternoon and the rest at evening. So that's what I plan, but I guess we'll see when the Saturday gets here and what's going to happen. But anywho, that's going to be in the stream for today. Let me see if I can find someone to raid. Oops, excuse me. I'm sure I I'm sure I'll be able to. It's just a matter of who. So far, that's looking like it's going to be a uh, little pa new, new pal Venom Reviews. He's looks like he's playing Overcooked 2 with well, with co-op. <laughs> <clears throat> so that sounds like it's going to be interesting. Yeah, uh, so I'm going to end my stream and I'm going to be reading into Venom Reviews. Who normally does like Final Fantasy 14, so if that's something you're interested in, maybe give him a follow when you get there. Either way, I'm going to end my stream and we're going to hop on over there. So see you there. And if I don't see you there, then I'll see you next time. Have a great day.